Okay guys, Shannon's got the trunk welded in and he has determined that we're about an inch high right here, so that's gonna have to get addressed. But right now he's inside and he, we're gonna take out the back window and we're gonna cut this sail panel out up to the seam here. So that's what's happening right now. Let's watch for just a minute. These windows are glued in, so they are they don't really have a gasket, but they're a pain to get out. And there's usually rust all around the channel where the window fits. So we'll come back in a minute and uh, show you what it looks like. Let's watch just a little more of this. Helps to have the right tool for the job, that's for sure. It's pretty cocked in, so Shannon's going to go around the outside here and see if we can get it broken loose. The back window's going to get replaced. It's really scratched up and not very good. So I'm going to have to get a new T-bodies only detail. Okay, Shannon's working on the other side. On this side, as you can see, it's loose. So we're going to let him finish up with what he's doing on the other side and it'll probably come out nicely. Okay guys, there's that back window. It's out. And then let's go in. Here's the old quarter panel. Let's take a look in here real quick. So, here we are. we got to get all this rubber stuff off. But uh, anyway, just want to show you the windows out. So we're going to move from here. Okay. We've got the window channel. I got all the clips off. Some of them are here. They are painting in the rear end. But we got the window channel pretty clean. Shannon's been over there working on the quarter panel, doing some straightening on the edges. And then let me show you something else here. He's been over here working on this uh, left quarter panel. He put a replacement piece down here, but he's been pulling, you can see right there, he's, he put some of those, uh, welded on some of those tips there and used a slide hammer to pull some of that out. Little hammer and dolly work. And then here on the tail panel, go ahead. He went ahead and welded on this trunk lock brace. So that's on there now. The other one was uh, rotted out right down here where it goes on. So that's done. So anyway, that's where we are at the moment. And uh, Smokey's taking a break outside. And Junior's over here taking a little break. Anyway, we'll get back to work now. Okay, I cleaned up the edges and Shannon is now getting the rust off of the outside of that right rear quarter panel in preparation to uh, put it on in the next few days. Just wanted you to see what was happening. Okay guys, just want to show you that we got most of the rust off of this quarter panel. And this is probably going to go in sometime this week. So once it gets on the car, then it'll be easier to work with. But right now, we got knocked the worst of the rust off of it, and uh, this will be going on. Shannon's over here, petting on Junior. And he uh, clipped the tail panel in place, just so you can see what it's going to look like once did the uh, quarter panel's got to go in first over there, but we just clipped it in place. And he, if you look closely, you can see that the right side is a little bit high. Shannon says it's about an inch high, so we have to address that before he can, you know, do much of anything else. But the plan is in this coming week to see about trying to get all the metal work done.
and we'll see how that goes. Anything else, Shannon? No, we just got to move that down and then I can get the quarter fitting up there, get everything uh, tapped in place and welded up. Okay. So we do have the floor. Yeah, he did get the trunk floor welded in. Welded mostly and glued in a couple of places. And the light colored stuff you're seeing is just body filler. It's going over the weld, so it you know looks nice and clean. So anyway, that's where we are this week. Talk to you later.